Good day YouTube. This is just a bit of a quick look at Linux Mint 19.3 as we can see here on the left and Linux Mint 20 in fact in its beta release out on the right here as well. So it's just a bit of a look between the two now as I've said the XFC desktop environment or edition there so you will see a lot of similarities probably one too many perhaps with the way that it works here but um, let's have a start off now so we can see here obviously XFCE uh, if we were to jump across, clean things up, have a look at uh, what else we've got going here. The file managers are fairly much the same. A few small tweaks, things here and there, not the least of which is the version in, but uh, otherwise just the same Thuna file manager there. So nothing too exciting. If we get into the, the back end of the actual system as well, uh, a little bit in terms of the backbone. So the one on the right, Linux Mint 20 XFCE, is in fact based off the Ubuntu 20.0. Uh, long-term long service release so it's supported until 2025 whereas Linux Mint 19.3 is, is barely supported for another year or so for instance there so you would want to upgrade at some point anyway now the software is fairly similar in nature there the look the feel everything really but it is probably a few more back-end things that we can't see uh, not the least of which there would be the Warpinator combination of a, uh, uh, I guess, software and uh, some, some back-end support there. Now, this is a, and we'll actually say here, send and receive files across the network. So it's a new version of a, something old that was around some time ago, but it just makes it uh, easy to, to share files amongst your own local network and other computers there that you've got, as opposed to relying on USBs and CD-ROMs, everything of the past there. Uh, there is also NVIDIA support, a little bit more NVIDIA support these days, which is quite good to see and you might be able to check that through some of your graphics settings there as well um, in fact it would be the device or d driver manager there if we can find that driver manager there it is uh, now there are some new themes uh, and color and icon support all sorts of things there which is really nice to see uh, there's a whole uh, themes and setting area actually no wrong spot but I won't really get into it right now but uh, yeah it has uh, updated some some icon packs some colors some themes that sort of thing there but um, that's pretty much it just a really super simple quick look guys um, probably the one thing I'd say is you do need to upgrade to it at some point as it does have a five-year service life uh, whereas 19.3 the slightly older version is uh, it's actually yeah, like I say about a year or so I think even nine months or less before this one runs out so uh, otherwise pretty graphically similar as you'll see there but um, you know what can you do it is what it is thanks for watching guys uh, please leave a comment subscribe hit that like button and I appreciate all your support and I do hope to see you again in the next one so cheers and have a good one ciao